welcome to LPS News. My name is Dave Pinto. Today we have some very amazing news, but the first thing we need to do is go to the COVID-19 news. All right, the COVID-19 news, here it is. Make sure to wear a mask out in public spaces especially now because everything is opening back up. Also, make sure to not have any friends over or you going to anybody's house. The next thing you want to do, for sure, is stay home, save a life. Don't need to go outside, don't go anywhere. And also, make sure to wash your hands. All right, now to the weather with Cousin Danny. We're back with the, you know, the forecast or whatever. Um, Cousin Danny, your meteorologist here. Um, so it's very sunny outside. I don't know if you guys can see that, but it's very sunny outside, as you can see. So, yeah. Now what we're going to be doing is something very important, and that is saying the most important thing of today. That is, it's 70, 70 degrees. 77 degrees. Oh, my gosh. I always mess up on that part. Um, so it's very sunny outside, like I said, and it's a really big sun, so you should go outside and play. Now, uh, back to Dave Pinto. Thank you, Cousin Danny. It's Dave Pinto, once again, from LPS News. We are just going to show a few things, um, no breaking news today, um, but we do have an interview. So here's the interview from the cast of LPS Butterflies. everyone welcome to your interview of lps news my name is starburst and i was actually named by someone in the comments i don't remember exactly who it was but all i do know is that some lovely person was nice in the comments and they decided the name for me which is starburst today we have the cast of lps butterflies which has been very requested to do more episodes of um, as you do know that one of the butterflies died, but, you know, it was just acting, you know. Um, so, we have all the butterflies here, all six of them, and here to be interviewed. Hello, Starburst. My name is, um, as you know it, Baxter. I also played a role in the LPS Tube Day Special um, as Charlotte's husband. Um, and actually, what I think is very funny about the um, the LPS Butterfly series is all the butterflies don't have names in the series. Um, we just wanted to keep it so that you can name them or whatever you wanted to do with the story. Um, but another funny thing that we wanted to share was that we lost one of the episodes that were originally going to be one more episode um, of LPS Butterflies, but we kind of lost the footage <laughs> and we never remade it. So, you know, that's so great. What is it like being on a highly demanded series? We've gotten so many demands to add episodes to the LPS Butterfly series. How, how, how do you guys do it? Like that was like the best series that we've ever made on this channel. Um, the only series we've actually finished. Um, that was a really good series and, but how does it feel to, you know, just be on a series that's so highly requested? That means you guys acted really, really well. It feels amazing, Starburst. I mean, like, our series was so highly requested, we might even just make some more episodes. Of course, I won't be in them, because as you saw in the episodes, um, well, I died, so. <laughs> still alive, guys, still alive, but in the series, I have passed away. It feels really great to just be in a series that's so highly demanded. What an amazing answer. I would have never answered better than you have. But now it is time for the next question, which is, do you guys think you'll be making any more episodes? Spill the tea. We're so sorry, Starburst, but we can't answer that question. 
but just know that there might be some episodes in the future after the finale and it might even be called something different so keep your eyes peeled for that because maybe there'll be another butterfly series who knows did you guys see that the tea was spilled there may be some new episodes of lps butterflies coming soon you never know but on to the next question did you guys actually have any fun making this series or was it more of a forced thing you had to do what a great question starburst and actually the answer to that is very very simple it was not forced at all i have two more questions for y'all and the first question is were you guys actually tired just making this series i mean it was a lot of work for rachel making all the scripts and also you know you guys acting and all this crazy things we were exhausted all the time, Starburst. I mean, it was not a forced thing to do, but it was amazing to have this job. And, you know, I don't regret it, and I don't wish I could take back time and go back. This was the most fun experience I've ever done on this channel. All right, final and last question. And that question is, this last question isn't really a question, but... It took so much from them to just make this series. Couldn't you see everything going on with Quinn and Dr. Franklin? It actually took Paige to real cry, just to make the sound effects of the characters crying. Yes, it did take quite a lot of acting and it was sort of hard to do, but you know, it's done and it was a really good video. So you know what? That's the last of the questions. All right, time for Dave Pinto once again. We'll see you next time on the interview section of LPS News. My name is Starburst. Good day or good night. Thank you, Starburst and all of the LPS butterflies. Now, back to me, Dave Pinto on LPS News. We have a new segment called the Jewelry Section. Basically, we'll just take a piece of jewelry every day, and then we will, you know, give a tour of the jewelry. Um, maybe you could buy a few if you see that you like one. And by the way, we're not sponsored. We're just doing this for a segment on LPS News. segment. My name is Devana and I am your host of the jewelry segment. Ah, I'm so excited. My first jewelry segment. I mean like it is amazing. Like don't I look like I'm jewelry eyes? I know that's not a word but you know we're gonna use it anyways. All right so um we're not sponsored by anyone in any of these segments um but we just want to show the jewelry off and maybe get the company to sell out a bit more. Um help a friend out you know. Okay so let's to the jewelry and it's called Stella Picciato. Don't really know how to pronounce it, but you'll see the box in a second. So let's get onto it. Okay, so here is the box. Stella Picciato. I don't know, but you know. <laughs> so let's open it up. So it is one fine piece of jewelry um normally if you get this jewelry this bottom part isn't scratched off with pen um i got this from my friend and um her little sister scratched it off um with pen or whatever um so my friend gave this to me and here is the piece of jewelry so it is a moon with some little gemstones or like big diamonds or something i don't know um and then we have some more diamonds or big diamonds or whatever they are at the bottom um, I don't know if they're real diamonds or fake diamonds, the, the back of the box is fine. And you can also take this out. So that is the jewelry segment. I hope you guys join us again for the jewelry segment. But, uh, see you next time. Back to Dave Pinto. Hello, my name is Dave Pinto and welcome back to LPS News, um, well, me. 
Um, so uh, here's our next segment, which is the book review segment. Um, these are not our books. They're made by other people. So yeah, just move on to the book review segment. Hello everybody, my name is Lucy, and well, we're here with the book review segment. Thank you, Dave Pintel, for making this possible. Um, so today we have an amazing book. We can't wait to show you this book. Here is our books that we have here today. And this book right here is the book we're going to be talking about today. The book is called Start Now, You Can Make a Difference by Chelsea Clinton. Number one, you, New York Times bestselling author of She Persisted. This is an amazing book, and I read the whole thing, and it is amazing. It talks about all the different things that you could do to save the planet and just help everyone in general. This book has a bunch of different things you can do to help the Earth and do great things. So, it's actually signed by Chelsea Clinton. So, you know, there's different pages um, and different things of, like, see, like, respect. See another page. Oh, there's Chelsea Clinton. Um, then we have over here, let's find another page. Eating healthy. When a heart stops down here. Is your heart healthy? Upon editing, I discovered that, like, this section, like, of, like, this video is, like, like, five minutes long or whatever. And I was like, I need to cut this out so you guys get the idea, right? I said, like, too many times, by the way. There's a bunch of cool things in here and how to help the earth out a bit. Thank you for joining us today from the book review. My name is Lucy, and good night. Hello, welcome back to LPS News. Well, me, Dave Pinto. Oh, we had quite an eventful day, and these are our new segments. Well, we have another new segment, which is going to be Beauty with MC Swag. Um, I don't know why she got this job, but she's not even an LPS, and she got this job. Uh, she's just going to talk about beauty and stuff on this segment. I, I don't know. Hello, my name is MC Swag, and a lot of people say I sound like Cousin Danny, and I'm like, no sir, I do not sound like Cousin Danny, and uh, you know, I don't even know why I got this job, because I'm not an LPS, and I really didn't think I was going to make this job, but yet I did, um, so, you know, yeah. So my name is MC Swag, and I am the beauty specialist, <laughs> you know, <laughs> maybe not. But, um, I am doing the beauty segment from now on, so, yeah. Here is the product of today. I love this Johnson's, um, you know, like, baby cream oil. It works so well if you have, like, dry skin and eczema. It is amazing for that. Um, it's not, like doctor proven to like help eczema but it helps mine so you know it's pretty good it moisturizes for 12 hours 24 hours that's even better right there um it's a pretty big bottle eight fluid ounces which is basically just eight ounces um so oh actually it is uh, <laughs> oops at the top i'm gonna move the camera up so actually, it's clinically mildness proven. I don't know what that means, but maybe it's like something doctors and proving whatever this is. I don't know. Ugh. I still don't understand why I got this segment, but you know, whatever. Um, so whatever, just use this lotion. It's great. Um, um, careful if you're allergic to it. I don't really know what's in it, so just. Here's some of the stuff in it. Oh, wait, that's not the stuff <laughs> over here. Whatever this is. <laughs> oh, no, I'm going to block out my name right there because my name is right here. <laughs> my full name. So, yeah. Okay, so here's all my stuff right here. Like, it's, like all stuff right there, whatever. So, yeah. <laughs> 
So yeah. You know what? Go back to Dave Pinto. I'm all over this. Finally, back to me, uh, Dave Pinto. Um, this is a segment I actually get to do, which I'm so excited for because um, I don't have any other segments besides introducing the coronavirus news or whatever, whatever is going on in the world. And also, this is my new segment, and it is the color of today. Uh, so bring the scrunchie in that has the color. This is the color of today. Uh, whatever this is, it's like a blue, green, something. So just try to wear it today. Next up is the toy review section. So yeah. Welcome to the new segment, which is toy review. Um, my name is Stella, and you know, I really have like this really cute star on my head. It's amazing, and I have really skinny legs. Like, okay, I'm like a skinny legend, peoples. Okay, so these are the toys in the background. It's a little squishy thing, and little poopsie slimes are kind. And you also have a squishy and a lost kitty, which we don't really like lost kitties because they're taking over our kind. Littlest Pet Shop is going down because of Lost Kitties. Hasbro, work on your Littlest Pet Shops. Ah, this segment is not for Littlest Pet Shops. It is for like other types of toys, you know, maybe they're struggling or something and we don't want their toy kind to die. So, I mean, like, we like LPS, but you know, there's room for other different types of toys too. So, yeah. Here is a toy that we're going to be discussing today. One last thing before LPS News is done. So, today's feature channel is Foxy Floof Studios, and I'm going to include a picture right here. So, go subscribe to her. I love her channel. Um, I know she's not a big YouTuber, but I still like her channel a lot, and I wish we could do a collab someday. Um, I know she has new generation LPS and, like, fake, like, old LPS, but she's still a really good LPS tuber, and I think her videos are really funny. So, maybe... Foxy Foof Studios, we could do a collab one day. I really like that. And make sure to go subscribe to her. We'll see you in the next episode, and goodbye, everyone!